So you made it to 2024 in one piece. One piece. <clears throat> but just because it's 2024, that doesn't mean you are a better person. Don't do resolutions. Don't do promises. Just do you. All right? Um, every year I say the same thing. I'm going to get in better shape and look like that guy. Yeah, right. Um, I say I'm going to be more cautious in what I collect. Don't happen. I'll find some other rabbit hole to fall down. Don't be that person who makes resolutions. It just doesn't happen. Be yourself. Be unapologetic. Do you be happy. Okay? Now, speaking of being happy, this is the first toy haul of the year, but it did happen in 2023. Um, literally that Saturday, I had got some stuff right before going to the uh, AEW pay-per-view. Um, Friday, I had got something, which was this dude. Yeah. Mr. Doc Ock from the Spider-Man 2 movie. Got him. Definitely can't wait to open this. Um, there's no room. You can tell this is, this is just that figure. Um, still got the windowless box, but that's okay. This is like going to be a thing of the past soon. They went back to their mirrors. But yeah, we had got the Doc Ock. I had pre-ordered him off of a Big Bad Toy Store. And they tell you, hey, your shipment is coming. And you got to pay attention because it comes. They, their stuff comes. So Big Bad Toy Store, um, use your pre-orders with Big Bad Toy Store if you don't trust Amazon because Amazon was a jerk to all of us in 2023. I don't know about you, but they canceled a lot of my figures. That's why I still don't have the Batman and Robin wave. They really did me dirty. Um, but yeah, Big Bad Toy Store, once it gets in, in stock, it may not say it's in stock on the website. It's going to still probably say pre-order. Just check your emails or listen out for somebody dropping a box outside your door. Now, that Saturday, it just came off of Amazon. Storm Collectibles. Reptile. I had to. <clears throat> I just had to. Um... This figure right here, let's just say I should have been getting the line from the beginning, but I didn't like the uh, $55 price point then. Now they range, right, now they're roughly um, $75 and up. If you get a special edition, $150, even $200. There's a $200 Luke Hang on Big Bad Toy Store right now with a, with a yellowish orange green, uh, yellowish orange red flame effect dragon fatality figure and him and himself but this right here i had to because mcfarland dropped the ball on the mortal kombat multiverse and he ruined it he gave us a ton of repaints for the for the dc multiverse but when it came to mortal kombat he already had messed up by doing them every quarter if y'all had noticed every other quarter every four quarters he was dropping two figures that i didn't like then all of a sudden it was all these repaints and repaints then it just stopped and that sucked that sucked. Um, with all the DC multiverse and um, the spawn figures, you think he would have kept on going with the uh, Mortal Kombat. But he didn't. And these two, for the first time um, in a while, I had ordered from um, Big Bad Toy Store. And they didn't put it in the um, Big Bad Toy Store typical box with their branding all over it, which I have somewhere. But um, anyway, two figures came from that. Because I couldn't trust Amazon. No more. Lots of bubble wrap. Bubble wrap. And every time you order from Big Bad Toy Store, they give you a sticker. I always like that. I don't stick them nowhere, but... Anyway, first up, we have the Superman. We got Superman and Crypto. Superman and Crypto is here. Not Platinum. I'm glad because I don't like the platinum one. It looks weird. It looks too stupid. Uh, what's that say? Does that say it? What are we doing here? Superman and... No. What are we doing? Okay. <laughs> on, on there it looks, it looks crooked anyway. But anyway. Superman and Crypto. I'm going to change the cape out for him. This cape, I might, put, I might put a wire with it. I can't stand that we got that pre-posed garbage. Everybody else is praising it. I don't like it. Even if you didn't want to um, 
make articulation articulated legs all the legs should have been down I don't like this one one leg up crap so that's very annoying and this Superman is ridiculously massive but I wanted it didn't get to because this head scan could actually be the one that goes on the solar suit Superman and of course because I'm a Batman I'm gotta get every Batman we got the Green Lantern Batman when I do this review I'm gonna um, compare him to the Batman that I created the Green Lantern Batman that I created and then right two weeks later they made this which was crazy and of course you, you see how he is um, McFarlane likes to make everything he likes to make a few bits collector's edition at least we got a lot of hands reused parts he comes with the lantern at least so that's okay um, and a lot of people was pointing out how these, these should be white I like it better that it's silver I like it better that it's silver I'm not gonna hold y'all up but that's what we got two McFarlane's one Marvel Legend and one Storm Collectible I like your boy y'all thank you I appreciate y'all for watching I see the uh, Marvel Legends <laughs> is the thing to do is the thing to do but like I said for the hundred the, for the hundred a couple of hundred people <laughs> who watches for the uh, McFarlane DT multiverse I appreciate you I thank you I'm a little tired but I thank you my back is freaking killing me um yeah and whoever's going to dynamite this Wednesday in New Jersey look for me say what's up just don't give me a man hug because my back hurts. Later, y'all.